Okay, guys, I just want to talk about, because we, we did the parts already. Um, my concern is, I will give you credit if you show this, if you plug everything in right, but... Uh, my only concern is, you know, to plug it in correctly. So on your quizzes, on the things where we messed up, is when you try to divide everything, you need to do this first. Type that in. What does this really mean? One half, 20 times 5.6. 20, 20 times, 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 20 times the 5.6, then divided by 2. That's what we do first, order of operations, and then we're going to add the 25 to it. So go ahead and figure out what is that 20 times 5.6 divided by 2. That ends up becoming 56. Then we add the 25 to that. So we get what? All right, go ahead and write it down. What I noticed on some of the things that we've done is you don't follow through. Like, I'm not going to give you everything. If you understand, you're going to compute it, calculate it, and get the answer. You should be checking after you've done it to see that you have the right answer. Everyone's already yelled it out, so just make sure you have that. All right, so we're going to number nine. R yeah, 2 pi R H plus 2 pi R squared. Good. First thing you give me the formula, you got some points there. Now, in the formula, what parts do we need, really? The radius and the height. The radius and the height. So we hopefully can read it and identify it off the shape. Yes, radius is 7. And our height is 9, our distance between the circles. So all I need to see at this point is you plugging in the numbers <laughs> for each. Calculate it. Go ahead and plug in the parts. Do it on your own. Just check to see if you're on the right track, and you're going to get it right tomorrow. I can't. 224, yeah. If you got to 224 pi, then you did it right. Kilometer square. What do we multiply together here? 2, 7, and 9. No. 2 times 7 times 9, what does that give us? Yeah, this is 126 pi plus, we have to do the exponent first, guys. So 2 pi times 49. 7 squared is 49. So that ends up becoming 98 pi. No. Yes. And then we add it to the 126. That's how we get to 24. All right, I'm 10. Formula, different formula though. Read the formula. Shut up. Mm. Are we supposed to find the surface? Oh, sorry. All right, pi R L, yeah, it's the surface there. Pi R L plus pi R square, square excuse me. <laughs> okay, the key to this, do we know the radius? Four. Okay, do we know the L? Yes, we should know it. Yes, guys, it's slanted. Y'all know what slanted means, right? To the side. So can we get some? So we have the R, we have the L. 9.8 L. The radius is 4. Wait, how much is 7? 7. 7. 
So we have to do four times the 9.8 first. Oh, yeah, 39, sorry. Plus the pi r squared. <coughs> Yes, centimeter square. <laughs> 